morning, you guys. Um, starting out this morning by running up and down the stairs 30 times per usual. Getting my glasses and my vitamins because I forgot them. Kaya's still laying in the bed watching her iPad. Um, today I'm recording several videos for you guys. I have to clean my house. It's a complete disaster from doing the bathroom this weekend. So I'm gonna be recording that for you guys. Doing a day in the life. Um, this one will probably be up after the cooking clean with me. But hang on, I gotta put you guys on the tripod. Okay, so I'm just gonna do like a, like a chatty, like I'm gonna chat with you guys while I make some breakfast. First off, um, I have been, you guys know, like on my health journey. Today is my first day. I'm really like wanting to get back into working out. My chest hurts so bad though. I'm having some problems. Does anybody else feel like whenever they go to the chiropractor, I feel like I need to go more? Like it is making things worse, not better. Hang on. I've been going to the chiropractor like twice a week and I'm just went to seven adjustments and like it feels good for like an hour afterwards and then nothing so and just so you guys know like in like money <laughs> money terms that's like $350 that I spent on like going to this chiropractor and like trying to fix things so um I was not able to go last week because of the quarantine and it just made me realize I was like you know what Maybe I need to be doing like more yoga stuff at home. Um, anyway, mom is hurting a little bit today, but I'm really hoping to like get on the elliptical, get some workout, in, get some workout, get some exercise in. Um, so yeah. Anyways, um, this morning I like I have been skipping my vitamin C supplement. I'm going to be having a little bit here this morning because I'm just feeling draggy. Like I might be coming down with something and hopefully not my sickness that he had last week. So I'm just gonna do an extra little boost here this morning. I'm going to take my vitamins here and I'm going to make some eggs. Um, I'm gonna do an egg scramble, which I'm gonna do three egg whites, one egg, like full egg, um, and then I'll do some asparagus in there as well as um, like salsa over the top. Um, I might have some leftover pico from this weekend, so I might use that, but um, yeah. Okay, I'm gonna make some breakfast. I've got Riker in his high chair. He's having some lucky charms watching The Land Before Time. Kaya is still upstairs, like I said, up in the bedroom, laying in the bed, watching her iPad. It is almost 10 o'clock. <laughs> oh, that's my girl, lazy girl. <laughs> okay, so like I said, for breakfast this morning, I'm making like an egg white scramble. Um, I am gonna keep you guys updated. I'm hoping to do like daily check-ins with you guys, like tell you guys where I'm at my weight loss. Um, unfortunately, I was PMSing over the weekend and all like seven pounds that I've lost, I seem to have gained it again. So hopefully I can just knock that water weight back down this week. That's my only goal is that, and then start working out. Um, and then um, trying to incorporate my kale smoothies almost every single day. The days that I go to the office, it is a little bit harder to incorporate those smoothies because you have to like be at home to make those. Um, they're just not as good. Like if I took them refrigerated, they just wouldn't be as good. So um, like I said this morning, I'm just doing a, um, a scramble and I'm doing onions, um, half an onion. I love onions. I know lots of people don't, but I love onions. So I'm doing half of a yellow onion. Um, I did a small bunch of asparagus from my fridge that was going to go bad. Um, so I've got the asparagus and I usually use butter, but I'm trying to cut out the dairy. So I'm, I cut out the butter this morning. Um, and plus that's like a hundred calories guys, hundred calories. I know it's like good fat if you're doing keto, but I just, I need to cut some corners somewhere, you know? So I might have one sausage patty with my breakfast. They're just like the microwavable Jimmy Dean ones, um, which next time I think I'll do the turkey sausage because it's just a little bit better for you. By the way, I'm gonna do a whipped coffee, um, which is two tablespoons of instant coffee. I, you know what, I'll just show you. There you go. <laughs> Maybe let's sit on the chair and eat it. Can you show me your dress, your dance dress you wanted to wear today? Pick and choose your battles, guys. Pick and choose your battles. 
Somebody wants to start dance class again this year. Hopefully they'll be started back up this fall. Mm, makes me sad when she like wants to be involved in something and now it's a virus. Usually we do swim lessons in the fall, huh? Yeah. <laughs> Anyways, um, I realized I had ordered this last night in my grocery order. So this is what we're having for coffee this morning because it's way easier. Um, I get this for like $4.99 from the grocery store. This was my go-to for a long time. Um, and I think I might pick it up again. Sorry, Kai is watching like Barbie on YouTube right now. So, But anyways, I just take my iced coffee like this and I'll add some half and half and that's it. So I've got my eggs. I've got my coffee, and then I'm gonna add some salsa on top of this, maybe a little bit of sriracha too, um, and a sausage patty, and that's my breakfast. Okay, I just wanted to add as well, if you like have to have sweetener in your coffee, I highly recommend this monk fruit in the raw sweetener. It's so good. Um, I'm not like huge on my coffee being sweet. Um, this morning, just for giggles, I will add like a pinch, but um, this is what I make my keto cookies with as well. Super awesome, I get it from Walmart, so you can find it pretty much anywhere. Um, but highly recommend this for your um, zero calorie, zero sugar sweetener. Otherwise, erythritol, those are my two go-tos for sweeteners. Okay, before I can start the cleaning video, the cleaning video, um, why? I switched back into my peppy frevy shirt because I'm gonna go outside and lay some grass seed because Mike said it's going to rain in the next little bit and he wants me to get this grass seed out before. Um, Kai, you need to put a jacket on first though. Um, oh, very cool. We have to put some grass seed out before it rains and we've got some people coming over to fertilize the lawn this week too. So just a really good time to get some <clears throat> grass seed like to overseed. Um, also, I burnt my finger so bad. The only thing, I was like panicking. I, like I can deal with pain pretty well, but um, this was just like, it was pushing me over the top. I was like, oh, I don't know what to do. Um, and then finally I found some like lidocaine and put that on there. Yeah, yeah, and then Ooh, then, so and much I, better. And I said, mom, please give, mom, get some of those two ices and put them on your hand. Yeah, you helped me, didn't you, kid all? Yeah, sweet thing. Okay, I gotta get my jacket on, take this garbage out, and then we have to go lay some seed down, which means, Kaya, we need to go get the grass seed from in the garage. Yeah, it's so dusty though. I'm so cute, look at, I <laughs> do not match at all. I have the same duck as my mom. Yep, make sure you put your rain boots on with that cute sparkly tutu dress. I wonder if my neighbors think of me. I promise I'm a good mom. Mom, mom, look at my shoes. You found my shoes. <clears throat> mom, this is how this is how I wear. Okay. We got two things of garbage we gotta take out. My phone. Okay. We got a we're gonna scoop it up into this thing. Yeah, scoop up into this thing. Hang on, like this. Make sure you get all the spots that don't have grass. <laughs>
I just got done having some lunch. I went outside and um, like raked the entire yard. I was going to do a clean with me today. Guess not. Um, Mike texted me and was like, hey, can you run outside and oversee the lawn um, before it rains? Um, it still hasn't rained yet. I think it's supposed to start raining any minute. But um, I ran outside really fast. And then two and a half hours later, here I am. Actually, it's been like three hours now. But um, yeah, I went outside and I raked like all of the dead stuff up all of the dead stuff. Um, I raked all of that up and then um, I overseeded the entire yard. That took me quite a while, it took me like two hours and then at the very end, I, it's gonna rain soon though. And Kaya was with me, she did really good. She was playing in the camper for most of the time. Um, and then I planted like, we've got like ornamental grasses, quote it down. Um, we've got like ornamental grasses in the front, like in our rock garden. So I replaced two of them that died. Um, and I threw away the old ones. Yeah, and then I called my friend who owns um, a landscaping company and arranged for them to swing by and do like a um, starter fertilizer later this week and um, do like a touch up, like a like spot treatment to our weeds. But yeah, anyway. It's been crazy. Too nice. So Riker has shots. It's 2.20 right now. Riker has shots at 3.20, so in an hour. Guys, Riker, it is 2.20 right now, and Riker has shots at 3.20. Um, I need to leave here by about 2.45 to make it there, so I have to leave in like 25 minutes. Um, yeah, I did not get as much cleaning as I wanted to today. Get as much cleaning done as I wanted to today. Um, but tonight I will be hammering down and cleaning a bunch because um, my house is just a mess. But this morning, hang on, Aslan, get down, get down, get down. Um, this morning, as you guys saw, I totally burned my finger. It hurts so bad, so bad. Um, it's probably like the worst I've ever burned to myself, to be honest with you. I didn't want to drop the pan, so I just like held on to it. That was not a great choice because now it hurts so bad. But um, anyways, I won't be able to do the dishes and that's what I was really hoping to get done was like the dishes and I want to like clear off that ledge up there if you guys can see. Um, I want to get the ledge done. Um, just like all, it's just like a bunch of like leftover construction supplies from um, the bathroom renovation. So, which I will be revealing the bathroom renovation like in full, I mean, you guys have probably already seen it on Instagram. Go peep my Insta down below if you want to see. Um, but I am planning on doing, I got a whole bunch of stuff to reorganize the bathroom too. And I want to do like a closet and bathroom reorganize Kamari method. Like I've been planning this video for a while. Um, so anyways, I just want to like get into it. Um, anywho, so I will be, like I said, tonight I plan to record um, the beginning of my cook and clean with me, um, maybe like into the night, like clean with me and show you guys, um, like seriously, my house is such a disaster. Anyways, I've got that cook and clean with me coming for you guys. Um, on Thursday this week, I will be recording what I am making for dinner tonight. And that is, I mean, we're just going to be doing like a grilled meal. So we're going to do like T-bones, but I want to show you guys how we make our artichokes. Um, we have, especially when I am, um, trying to lose weight actively, um, we'll have a lot of artichoke and asparagus because those are my two favorite vegetables. Um, Artichoke is so, so good, you guys, and it's so easy to make. Um, I feel like a lot of people buy canned artichokes. Coda, get down, you stinker. Um, I feel like a lot of people get canned artichokes, and those are like vinegary and super gross. Um, these are so good, I promise you. But I will be doing a cooking clean with me for that. What? What's wrong? My neck is broken. I picked the other one yeah, I picked it up for you. If you guys want to see my like cook and clean with me, make sure you stay tuned for that on Thursday. Um, I will be cleaning the entire rest of the house tonight after Riker's appointment. And yeah, all the things. Okay, turn the TV off. Okay, let's go to get your shots. He's like, 
15 months and you're just getting your one-year-old shots because of all this corona stuff. Yeah. <laughs> Look at him. Look at him. Should we go get your shots? Yeah. Go see how big you are. Okay, guys. I'm going to leave the camera at home oh. and I'll check in with you as soon as I get back. <laughs> Poor guy. Poor buddy. So so Can we tell him? Hmm? Should we tell him? What happened? Uh, Riker had five. See, so you had five. Five shots today. Um, and then he had his blood drawn on his finger. So he had six pokes. But he is 25 pounds and 32 inches. He was like, yeah, 82nd percentile. And he's doing really good. He met all of his milestones. They only want them to say like two or three words. But he says quite a few. Like... He'll say, like for example, when we were in the office today, in the doctor's office, um, they, um, oh, 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 hey. Okay, can you grab me a napkin or a wipe to clean that up? Um, when we were at the doctor's office, he, oh, or Riker will just eat it right off the blanket. That works too, buddy. Thanks. Um, anyway, so he, when we are at the office, said like, what's this, what's this, what's this, a million times. Um, and he likes to say dad a lot. Um, I think, oh, I forgot to tell Mike this. I think this morning, Mike, I figured out when he goes, Aya, Aya, he's yelling for Kaya. Oh, really? Yes, because I I said, buddy, where's Kaya? He goes, Aya, Aya. Miss Kaya today? Yeah. Anyway, he did really good. Poor guy. What do you think? Dad got my shot. Yeah. Here, let's wipe your hands off. <laughs> yeah, he's over it. Yeah, you were crawling and climbing all over the place in that hospital room or that clinic room, so I want to <laughs> wash your hands. All right, guys, I'm going to end it there for today. Um, I have a huge, like, get it all done with me like I've been talking about. Um, there is going to be yard work in there. There's going to be um, like cleaning the house and organizing and um, like a cook with me, a couple of different like sections of like food. So I'm gonna show you guys how we cook our artichokes. Um, and then I'm also going to like show you guys like a home cooked, like low carb, healthy meal. Um, yeah, so by the way, meal, meal. It is now officially raining, so that's awesome. Um, the grass seed that I got in the yard, I got it in just in time, and it's not like super windy, and it's not like a like heavy, heavy rain. It's just like a light rain that's going to hopefully allow the seeds to germinate here within the next few days. Fingers crossed. Mike thought this was like the perfect time to like seed down, so hopefully he's right. Hopefully we caught it at the right time so that we can fill in the rest of our yard. Um, we should have mowed beforehand, but mm, oh well. <laughs> We're not the best oh, at mowing our lawn. I, but I found something. What did you find? I found something really I'm mowing just before it's ridiculous. Oh gosh, yep. These are my glasses that broke. These are my old glasses. They're dead. I don't have the heart to throw them away yet, though. All right, you guys, make sure that you subscribe to my channel before you leave so you don't miss out on all of our um, hot mess awesome videos, so you don't miss out on my cleaning videos. Those are some of my favorite ones to record are like the huge long montage videos because they're so motivational. But make sure you're subscribed to my channel before you leave. That was really hard to get out. Um, I have that cleaning video coming. I'm so excited to put like the next cleaning videos that are coming up. I'm so excited for. Um, and then I think I'm gonna do like a um, like a summer decoration, like a summer decorating video, farmhouse, modern farmhouse, boho decorating video. I've got my spring haul coming for you guys in a couple of days as well. Um, that one will probably go live on Saturday. I might get it all done with me, um, like ultimate clean with me, whatever you wanna call it. That will be going up on Thursday and then on Sunday. I can't decide if I'm going to do a like day in the life vlog um, or if I'm going to like fill you guys in on some projects or what I'm going to do. But anywho, 
All right, I will see you guys in a couple days for another really fun video. Leave the video a big thumbs up, leave a comment below. Okay, bye guys.